I, I want you to tell me about what you remember about Eddie Belmonte. Oh my goodness, that's a, we, was, we want to go way back. Way back. That made me old. Tell me about that Tony legendary Belmonte, guy. One of the best, man. Yeah. He was good, nice guy, intelligent. He was a nice guy on the horse, at the horse. That guy was timing. Timing. Yes, sir. I mean, every ray, different horse, but he was one of the best riders, man, ever. Ever, huh? What, yes, made, what made him so good for you? Yeah, that guy was class. Class. That guy, see you, good morning, how are you, how you doing today, you know. Very, very fellow, good fellow, I would say, like yeah, a brother. Like a brother. Every time you see anybody, then, you know, always show his class. And like I say, on top of the horse, he was one of the best. He was a race rider, Rooting huh? on the track, at the track. Man, that guy was unbelievable. Johnny Berman. Yep. And even when people started riding horses, he come around and telling, look, this is do like this, like that, da, da, da. This is how to go. He was one of the best. I tell you why, he's like, like Chris McCarron. Yeah. Come on. Came out with a good jockey, one of the best, high class. Then he went to jockey school. And he showed this guy how to ride horse, how to do the right way. Yeah. Man, Angel Cordero, the same way. Same way. Same way. Every single man from the old way back. You know, I'm going to visit the jockey school in Puerto Rico. Are you going over there? Yeah, I'm good, go. good, I'm, I'm good, go good, good. Yeah, there. do that. You're going to have fun over there. I told yeah. you that. Yeah, we're going to we talk. We got a lot of, lot of guys coming up. A lot of young talent. A lot of young talent. Yes, sir. But uh, yo, that guy was the best on the horse. On the horse. Man, every race, they always like competing. I got the best horse. You got the best. We're going to get it on. Yeah. Yo, it was unbelievable. Yeah. Way back. That was a real story. Yeah, you know, back in them times, right, when Belmonte was riding, what was racing like back then? It was different, like today, big different, but, you know, the emotional and the passion is the same. Yeah. You know, even the money was kind of low, you know, and, and, and the way back the money was no, no. But the it passion. was no that one thing you got in mind. You just ride and make the day go, you know, yeah. and take care of your business. So that was the whole point. Now everything is money. Uh, you know, trophy, <laughs> yeah, yeah, Rolex yeah. watch. Yeah, yeah. And those days, it was nothing like you win, you win. It was the crossing the wire. Win, even when you win a claiming race, it's like win a Kentucky Derby. Wow. It's a, you feel that. You feel that. You know what I mean? So everybody's happy about it. Yeah. And every time you're training and I want to win a race, you know, with cheaper horses. Didn't matter. Doesn't matter. We win. We win. They like to see the horses go across the finish line. Yeah. And we don't do it this time, we go next time. Yeah. You know, this is go like that. Yeah. Open it until you get a ride. Yeah. So. But yeah, it was a bit different. Yeah. Take the horse to the, to the spa, swimming in the ocean, you know, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. You know, to make sure that the horse is right. You know, now you just, and some fun you got swimming pool. Over here we got a spa. But in the way back, it was no swimming pool. You just take it to the, take to the, to the ocean. real beach and <laughs> let them have it. Wow. Yo, the horse are enjoying that. They love the beach, huh? Ooh, like we do when we go in there. Yeah. Same way. So.